Hello, this is an overview of the Frame Story Kit. I'm going to quickly show you all the main contents of the Frame Story by navigating in our scripts UI. The first thing that you're going to see is the Character tab. In this tab, you can choose between three characters man, woman, child and modify their appearance. You can select one of these pre made outfits, which are 255 in total or create your own by combining different clothes, accessories, hair and facial features. Let me quickly browse through the man's outfits. We see astronaut, detective, graduate, king, scientist, taxi driver. And at the very end we see a collection of famous people. The same thing applies to the woman outfits. We see a lot of them covering different jobs or activities. And of course, here are some famous women. Anne Frank, Coco Chanel, Frida Kahlo, Joan of Arc and more. Let's head over to the child outfits. We see many cute little outfits where each one determines its sex. Now let's go back to the woman and see the rest of the modifying options. We can select different clothes, chain tops, skirts, dresses, select shoes, hats, face shapes. Noses, hair, and various accessories such as glasses, earrings, masks, necklaces, and many more. Now let's go to the Animation tab, where we can browse through a collection of 255 poses and many pre-made expressions. These poses cover most of the actions that you might want to use in your video. Your character can laugh, cry, eat, sleep, catch items, walk in different styles, and so much more. Here, we just click on the Expressions button and see five pages of pre-made expressions, such as angry, crying, confused, happy, sleeping, a combination of different facial expressions like angry to yelling. Feel free to browse through all of them, because there are a lot. Now let's go to the Scenes tab. Here we can select through more than 100 amazing scenes and sites from around the world. This is a huge collection, you don't have to make a scene anymore because of the lack of content. In addition, we have some image filters to give a final touch or a certain look to your videos. The props category is a huge collection of different items separated in many categories. We see electronics, food covering bakery, beverages, cooking, fruits, snacks, vegetables. Of course, each element that you see in the frame story has its own animation. In the home category, we see beds, kitchen, living room, we even have whole sets of furniture to save you time. We also have medical items, money, credit cards, many vehicles, ships, airplanes. In the urban category, we have many props to quickly create a city scene. You see lights, traffic signs, buildings, and even cities. In the work category, we have office sets, many small office items, and different tools. The various category is a big collection of many different items or animals that we wanted you to have. There are many subcategories in here, covering different animals, athletics, containers, cosmetics, educational items safety items, travel, weather, and many more. The suggestions category is basically fresh ideas on how to combine the props category with your characters. Of course, if you click on any of them, you will get the item you see on the image you clicked.
The Library tab is a great collection of different pre-made, customizable elements that will make your idea come to life in no time. We see Compo Graphics, which are essentially a collection of animated compositions that deal with a variety of situations such as travel, job ads, discounts and much more. Here we see many hand gestures where you can place your own items, logos or message. In the Icons category, we see many general icons including currency, information, music and more. We also see some internet and social media icons. Here we see many different infographics where you can easily add your text and values and they will automatically be included in the animation. In the logo reveals we get some nice logo revealing animation where you can freely use the logos that you see or replace them with your own. In the motion styles category we have a collection of various useful shapes, each with its own animation. We see bursts, circles, lines, polygons, triangles, waveforms. In the symbols we have arrows, crests, labels, ribbons, tags. In transitions we see almost 100 transitions arrows, blinds, circles, clocks, liquids, pixels, rectangle. Typographies are a very elegant collection of animated typography separated in three categories. The general category that you see here. The stickers which are very helpful for sales, discounts, parties and more and the vintage category that has many vintage typography elements to make your company name look awesome. In the word bubbles category we see many different word bubble shapes, internet chat conversations and a combination of word bubbles with faces. Finally we have the extras preview button. As you can see in this section you can have a preview of extra elements that are not selectable from the UI panel. Also, you can see where those elements are located inside of After Effects or inside the Frame Story folder in your disk. In the next few pages, we see a mapping of all the expressions and lip sync elements so you can work inside of After Effects without having to switch between PDFs and HTML files. Next, we have a preview of the camera presets, the shape presets, and the narratives. That's it for the overview. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.